Sunday night, I had to come back and post again on this comet after doing some 101 research on this constellation sextant, which is a, like a navigation tool like they use in the old days. I mean, the ancient days. They still probably do use them. I mean, if you lose your GPS, basically look up the stars and guide you in the right direction in a nutshell. Getting to this constellation, and this is where, taking a look here quickly, just glancing through it. This is constellations of words. I think I hit a home run here. I really do because the timing take a look here i'll just point them out christian saw representation of the sidereum veronica the sacred handkerchief of saint veronica in the stars of sexton the face cloth that bears the resemblance of the face of jesus imprinted on it not the shroud of torin that covers the body saint veronica was a woman from jerusalem who was moved with pity as jesus carries cross to here's a quick video from i have to pause it because for so he, i remember this she put the cloth, he took the cloth. Jesus accepted the offering, the image of his face mysteriously imprinted upon it. The vent coincides with the sixth station of the cross, Veronica, face of the cloth. And it goes on. I'm seeing what sticks out. There's a lot of things that are sticking out. I'm thinking about just the recent events on the 20th when they confirm 100% with that the Shroud of Torin is real. This is the same time period the comet entered this constellation. Also, we had the deaf sister Agnes of Akita who died on the, the Feast of the Assumption. Same time period, the comet was in, in this constellation. Wow, this is no coincidence. No coincidence at all. Continue, just glancing here. You could put it on pause and read it, but already shown a sign. Sexton is the Latin word which means six and sex, male and female. The sixth commandment forbids adultery, sexual intercourse with a partner other than your lawful spouse. Well, we have 90% of the divorces now being uh, initiated by the wives because the system supports it. They get rewarded. It's obvious this was planned out long ago. It was planned out long ago to do exactly what it's doing. So there we have it. A connection with Shroud, the face of Jesus. There's three of them. The one that was the Sidardium that was found in the tomb, wrapped up, which matches the blood, and the other one where she wiped the face of Christ, and that one's in the Vatican. There has been no blood test or anything done on it. It would be great if they took time to do testing on that to see if the blood matches with the AB blood type. Okay, that's where the comment's at. This is no coincidence. The timing, the timing of it all. On the cloth, the house of Veronica. So much here to read. So many videos out there. They're saying this is the face right here that the Vatican has. I mean, there's ways they could test that or overlay it with shroud. So that's what the consolation ties in with. Mystery of the veil, 14th century. Always refer to the 14th century when they build those big cathedrals. Okay, so that's what I have for now. Let me end it right here. I had to put this out. There's a message here.